spring a ling <laughs> I think we're gonna start it off with with Helix. Return of the King. Oh, Return of the King! <laughs> the throne presents itself. So there's actually a lot of interesting sort of lore behind this game that you can find out through extra materials in and inside and out of the game. So apparently there's four people that have like the arms ability. Like they have regular arms in real life, but you, you know, they, they transform into having stretchy arms. And that's uh, Springman, uh, Min Min, Ninjara, and Ribbon Girl. And then besides that, there's like these people who like have artificially created them. Like you know, of course, Bite and Bark are robots. Mechanica is a robot as well. Um, I don't know the deal with Twin Tail. She doesn't even have arms that are special. She just has hair. Uh, Helix was created in a lab to compete in the arms tournament. Uh, and then. Yeah, so in, 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 a, in any case, there's a bunch of interesting little stories for everybody involved, which is cool. I like it. Ah, oh, man. No. I'm a slippery boy. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh. Coming after you! <laughs> oh no! Oh! <laughs> oh no! Don't punch <laughs> my. Not enough, though. Not enough. Oh, I didn't even realize we were running out of time again. Did you see the dog was behind you trying to get you when you grabbed me? Yeah. Yeah, if you could if you could figure out when your dog was attacking and like hit me then, I'm sure you could score gigantic combos. I don't think it's like I think he just kind of randomly attacks. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's on a timer. Oh! <laughs> this timer thing. <laughs> yeah, we should increase the timer. I mean, I don't know if it can go any higher than 100 seconds. Oh, we could probably just, like, turn it off. I think we've just figured out that this game is about, like, dodge and hit, and so it's like we're always waiting for the other person to make the first move. Yeah, well, it's like a... It's it's a very complex game of rock paper scissors, which I guess every fighting is fighting game is when you think about it. Oh. 
How did I miss? <laughs> Man. Uh, I think I'm letting you in inside of a little bit of my strategy with, with Helix, but uh, he's so good at dodging that I, I barely ever feel the need to guard. He's, yeah, I mean... He's so good at dodging. Especially with I mean, the that's just kind of this game, though, is that it's just, you know... Like, erring on the side of, like, trying to get a dodge as opposed to, like, attacking. I feel like every time I attack first, I get punished for it. <laughs> Yeah, well, it's like, I feel like it's about, like, creating a situation for yourself where where you win. Uh, where, like, if you throw out a punch, you're still in a position where, you know, maybe you can dodge while while you do it. Throwing out both punches at the same time is often kind of risky. Um, but if you can trap somebody, then it's good. It's, it's, a, it's definitely a weird game in that respect. Oh! <laughs> oh man, so close. No, come here. Oh, that was awesome. Yeah, you see the dog? The yeah. dog is clutch. The dog is clutch. Yeah, it's probably the trade-off for he doesn't seem like he does much damage the this character. Oh no! <laughs> so funny enough, like I know this is my level and everything, but it's not, uh, it's not my favorite for Helix. Yeah, I feel the same way about Master Mummy stage for him. Ugh. No! Oh, no. Funniest sound when you when you hit him is ah! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Sometimes you do that for the intimidation tactic. Oh no. Oh when whenever whenever you get thrown the dog follows you and it's like it's just a sitting duck to get taken out. No oh, no Oh no. Oh no! I was trying to punch, but I, they just get beaten out every time. Yeah, the they're like heavier than most punches, but not as heavy as the Master Mummy punch. Ah, man, I really wanted to win with Bite and Bark, but I just I guess I just can't. Well, the other thing you could do with him is uh, if you jump on the dog, you'll bounce in the air, and I think it actually guards punches at the same time too. So I've noticed. Nah, I've been I've been doing that, but it just it just gives you another bounce. All right, let's switch up here. Let's see a character that we haven't seen in a while. I like this level a lot. I keep forgetting to change our our rule set. It'll happen sometime before the episode ends, or not, or not.
I call slapping the fire out of you. Because <laughs> they're fire slap -a -manders. Ah, I like dodged right into that. Oh, oh. oh my goodness, that did so much. Wow, 470. Oh no. Noise. Yeah, um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, it's like when you can hit with that, it seems to do a lot. I think this guy's like a cop. Yeah. That's kind of the look he gives off. I feel like this guy's arms get beaten by, like, everything. Yeah, what's their charge attack? You know when you guard for a second? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't seem to do anything. Well, you know when the arms change? You have to use it immediately, but... But you'll throw the punch and you'll notice, like, a, an effect. I just want to win with this character so bad. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Yeah, you can also try switching arms. Nah. I'm just going to keep rolling with it. I always win the first match, and then I just can't seem to win after that. Man, I feel like I keep getting my arms disabled. Well, the that's what the electric effect does. I think your arm does the same thing. Yeah, if it does, then I haven't seen it. Well, you know when you guard and your arms start glowing? If you punch from that... Oh, okay, so that's what... Whatever you just did, that was the charge attack. Yeah, I'm... This is just not gonna happen. <laughs> Trust in the uh, the fishies. I'm gonna try them out. My my character actually has the same arms, except mine do fire. 
Oh wow, they explode on impact. Interesting. So they still do damage even if you miss with your charge attack. Is that so... Ah. Yep. Robot versus robot. Oh <laughs> my goodness. Man, that's the crazy thing with the dog too, is you block the you block the guards. Or they they grab they block grabs for you. What, with the tongue? Yeah. Or no, just just like your grab will hit him first and then you can't do anything about it. Okay, let's see here. I'm gonna use these uh hammers. I haven't even seen those. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Bop. Bop. Oh, 100 damage. <laughs> oh no! We disable each other. <laughs> I'm surprised you still get that ability with arms like that. Yeah, I don't know. Can Maybe any that's... character use any set of arms? I think so. Ah, oh, man. I still got 200 damage off. Oh, no. Quick grab always gets me. Always gets me. Beep, boop, boop, bop, boop, boop, bop. <laughs> That's all I, uh, I just wanted to see what he said. All right, uh, I guess I should try out somebody else now. Springling. What oh, level this is, is this? This is where Springtron was made. Oh, I almost played him too. Well, I don't think we've played this level. Yeah, I don't think we've ever played it. Oh, also, if you hold Y, your your punch will glow at the end of your dash, and you'll get a charge attack out of it. Wait, what? So you've got a charge attack. It happens when you guard, you'll notice your punches glow. Also, when you dash and hold Y, there will be a moment where it 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 uh it shines, and that your your charge attack will do a lot more damage. And then, like, uh, like, I think for, you know, for me, that's where, like, I get this freeze effect. Oh, yeah, I didn't even know that was a thing until now. Are you, like, reading, like, a instruction thing? No, I'm just, like, experimenting. I mean, I used to know how to play this game when I first played it, but it's, uh, back when it first came out. <laughs> oh! But I had you with that sneaky grab. Yeah, I thought I had you with like baiting that and then attacking, but I'm surprised you had time to dodge. Oof! Oh, I couldn't block. I was on the ground. Man, Springman. Spring-a-ling. Spring-a-ling. Oh, the thing... Uh, whatever these mat things are keep <laughs> getting in the way of my punches. I think they're punching bags. <laughs> oh, no! There's some weird-looking punching bags. They look like Helix. Yeah. That they do. Ugh! Oh no, I did not mean to grab. I 
keep grabbing by accident. Oh, what's, uh, something, like, stopped my grab? What is that? Oh, oh that was, she must have, like, a force field around her. Wow. Interesting. Okay. Now I understand why I always found Twintel so hard to fight online. Very interesting. It's okay, we got the Springling on our side. The power of the Springling! Yeah. Are you going for that perfect? He ain't going to get that perfect, boy! No, I'm not going to get perfect. Well, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, almost. Now it's time for the comeback! <laughs> Spring man, man. He's just too good. I gotta say, the characters are kind of growing on me. At first, I didn't, I didn't really like much of them, but uh, but I like Twintel. I like uh, I like Spring man. Spring man's growing on me. Who are you being? I just want to make sure we're not being the same guy. I was just picking Spring man again. Spring a uh, ling. Well then, uh, there's only one appropriate foe for Spring him. Springtron. No. no, Max Brass. Well, I mean, you say he's not the main character, so why are you using the villain? Uh, well, I think there's like a story rivalry for Max Brass and the other guy, but I actually don't know that well. Oh, and and you're saying that Springman has the rivalry? It's almost like he's the main character or something. <laughs> I honestly think Springman was like meant to be like the main character, but like people have the characters they like, and so when they were talking to the Smash Bros. developers, like everyone's the main character. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I was so close to getting that grab. My fists explode. <laughs> My boy, that, that chest blast. He reminds me of like a character from Wonderful 101 or like Captain Falcon or something. Yeah, that's... I think he's Captain Falcon's uncle. Whoa, this guy has like maximum distance on his fists. What a spring man's ability does. It just like his... Fists get orange. It's like a fire effect. It just does like some extra damage. A lot of them do that. Where like the electric ones I find to be the best. Ooh, this one's purple. I think besides Master Mummy, this is your guy. I find it very hard to beat your spring man. Your springling. Because I wanted him in Smash, so he's giving me the spring power. Springling! <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> oh, we must have different winning screens. We do. They, they say different things depending on whose screen we're looking at. Well, that's what, uh, Bite and Bark, I wonder if, uh... On my screen, he said the one time I won, he was like, "All bite and no, or all bark and no bite, or something like that." You know, they go slap him, Anders. <laughs> Look at the people in the crowd who are Kid Cobra fans. They have snake hats. Oh no! 
is this not Kid Cobra stage? No, this is. I'm pretty sure this is spring. Kid Cobra stage is the one with the. Uh, the it's the, the skate. The skating rink. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> oh, you're still in it. Oh, how did that miss? The grab miss. That was so weird. Oh, that's why. All right, so we're jumping into a new match because at the end of that uh, classic close finish, we got a uh, disconnection error. You know, Michael rage quit from the close <laughs> loss. Stuff. That's so hard to do with the Switch. Oh, I guess you just quit the app, but uh, yeah. Oh! My boy! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Get out of here, boy! <laughs> oh no! Spring a ling! <laughs> Sound like you said bop at the end of that bop. This is a pretty cool level. Oh no! Yeah, I don't who know stage is this? I don't know. Get out of here. Oh no! Oh! <laughs> oh! My boy! Spicy! Spicy indeed! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Springling! Yes! <laughs> I don't know, man. I like Spring Man. Once I saw I the, have, the comic I book have. of him uh, talking to his dad yeah. and his dad passes the mantle, I, 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 he's just missing things like that. Like, they should have cool, like, intro cutscenes in this game. Yeah, but you don't you don't have enough like opportunity to learn about the characters. I imagine they just didn't spend as much money on making this game because they they were worried about it not doing well, being like a new idea. Or maybe they just had to rush it out to make sure it was out the first year of the Switch's release. But whatever the case is, I'm I'm excited for them to eventually make a <laughs> sequel, or I hope they do at least. Oh gosh. <laughs> No! <laughs> no! Why do you sound like Darth Vader? <laughs> All right, here's where I come no! back. No! Oh. Oh, 
Oh, I did not mean to do that. What? I tried to press the joystick in and my brain thought press R. Oh, I still got one last slap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's a trade. It shows it right there. <laughs> well, there's those straightforward fists like that where, you know, you're you're wanting to have a direct confrontation. Uh, other ones, you kind of work around them like the slap Amander. Let's uh, let's take it back to Helix versus Master Mummy. I feel like that's how we how we have to end this thing. Not not uh, Helix versus Springman. Oh, I didn't uh, get to switch. Well, I mean, we could do one with Springman if you want to uh, see just how much harder it'll be fighting against uh, the stretchy man. You merely uh, stretch your arms. I am stretch. <laughs> it stretches me. It'll be actually interesting to see this uh, how this matchup plays out. It might be better yeah. for uh, fighting Helix as opposed to Mummy. It's funny. I used to think Springman was like pretty bad, but I don't know. I feel like he's pretty good. Well, he's a he's a fundamentals character. It's like he's got no gimmicks. He's just pretty yeah, good he's at everything. Like every but see, that's another reason why I look at him as, like, the main character. That's literally every... You notice in every game, that's always... Why is always the main character always, like, the worst? Or, like, you know, they do the least? Ugh. You remember, like... I'll give you an example. Donkey Kong 64. You remember DK's thing is pulling switches? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, his special ability. But that's the thing. That's, like, most games. It's kind of like Mario in a lot of games. He's just the all-around character. Tell you what though, if I was a just a regular man like Springman, I'd be pretty terrified about going up against Flubber here. Oh. <laughs> All right, Brown Two Helixes. I feel like he's gonna be tough. Oh. <laughs> well, this is some of the adaption that, like, we'd probably do more of if we were good at this game, but, like, I noticed that, like, I'm just getting beat out speed-wise, so I'm using this arm to kind of balance me out. Oh, no! How did I miss? That was so weird. Oh. Ah. Whoa, look, I'm like glowing. That must be a special ability. He must do better when he's got low HP. Goodbye! <laughs> oh! What happened with yours? <laughs> I just missed you. The thing it didn't, about on my screen, you weren't even attacking. Oh yeah, I think we're starting to get lag or something. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> I just thought I'd just walk up and try it. Oh, I had 
Behind you! He was right there! Oh! <laughs> my grab was right on you as that I special do. Oh my goodness, that was, a, that was a close one. One of our better matches. <laughs> Alright, are you going for the mummy next? Yeah, I'll go Master Mummy. Oh, not this one again. This is the, the that, when we played our last <laughs> last match. I don't I don't like this one for Master Mummy that much. Just the because it's it he does best when it's just like straight, like that main you know the main stage the one from Smash, that's like perfect for him. Oh yeah, especially with how tiny it is. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> Ow. Whoa, what's going on? Yeah, again, you weren't, like, doing anything for a second. Uh, well, my fists bounced over your head. Oh, goodness. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> you hear Helix? Yeah. Man, I just can never go with anything but the main fists. I just... <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, what happens? No! Man! I whiffed on both of those. Oh, you still had time to guard! <laughs> the master <laughs> return of the king you're right <laughs> <Don't look. laughs> oh man it's extra embarrassing because uh his shoes are just so atrocious and uh <laughs> my boy needs since. my boy needs to <laughs> up his shoe game all right well that's gonna be the end of uh our arm series for now we'll maybe eventually come back but that's gonna be it for these first few episodes, hope you enjoyed our journey through this game and uh, just all the fun combinations of arms and characters and matchups that you can get into. So we'll see you in the next series or uh, inside of uh, Super Smash Bros. Min Min's just gotten there. So in any case, we'll see you in the next fighting game series whenever that happens. <laughs>